what's going on everybody 18 willing eagle here how you all doing uh i was on wait to do my um eagles and falcons preview this coming friday night and saturday you know they're making more property you know but i'm just getting out the way now right now i'm actually here in my um tractor there's i'm actually at a shipper right now um dropping off some stuff dropping off some mushrooms that's all um so it's week two eagles at the falcons in their home in that damn dome um they got smashed last week by the vikings and i'm sure they're trying to come in pretty hot this week so um you know they're a past team they can run to my biggest fear would be julio jones because that guy can get that ball he can definitely score over your over your defensive back's head without any effort just about um got no trust in Jalen Mills Darby Avanti Maddox you know Avanti Maddox showed some promise last year but he hasn't shown me enough that oh okay I trust in this guy as if he were a lockdown cornerback I don't trust them guys like that, you know, that the D-line will always be good. Um, the secondary, even though we got Malcolm Jenkins in it, um, it's still suspect. Uh, so, yeah, um, you know, <clears throat> Chance, Matt Ryan, and Matt, Julio Jones, We'll both have a, a big day because they got a good connection like that. And they will score every chance they get. I mean, Matt Ryan and Julio Jones, when I'm passing to them, every chance they get or whenever you let them. So, that's just something to be mindful for. Um, I think we might manage. I don't see us getting blown out. Um, like Nacho Freak said, we haven't beat them at, in their home in a long time. So, but I still think we can come out on top, though, without any, any doubt. Um, it's not a game where it's a sure loss or a definite win. Um, so, overall, um, offense, I think we'll be fine. Um, I think our offense will do pretty well. Uh, Wentz will be fine. Deshaun Jackson should be fine. I'm not worried about um. Our, I missed the part. Um, I'm not too worried about Devontae Freeman because our D line is pretty good. So <clears throat> I think we'll be. I think we'll be finding um stopping um Devontae Freeman. It's now it's unfortunate. It's unfortunate that um. Malik Jackson's went down. It has picked up um, Akeem Spence from the Dolphins. So, you know, not that this would have made a big difference in the in the uh, run-stopping game. But, you know, I really wish we could have Clowney. And if we can make a trade for um, a decent or solid cornerback. Um, if you were a lockdown cornerback, that'd be a lot better. But just for a solid cornerback that can defend just about almost anybody, maybe not lock him down, that'd be good. But you know, um, hoping to make, have, have a deep playoff run this year. With the Pages having now signing Antonio Brown, which is like Natural Freak said, it sucks. That's that's a tragedy. That is a real tragedy. So, I'm not going to get too far off topic now. I'm going to take it one week at a time, one game at a time. So, overall, I got us maybe... If we lose, I say we would probably lose by maybe... Three points or six points. Maybe... I can see it being a high-scoring game. Maybe, I don't know, 37, 34... Something like that, you know. Or if we 
win. It's just going to be probably in the same range, you know, whether you win or lose. So, overall, y'all have a good one. Be safe out there.